Where am I? What's this painting? Right, I'm a Joseph's. Mm. What a night. Quite a celebration. Happy birthday, my friend. <laughs> Though, one drink too many. Mm. I'll check with Joseph and then I'm off to work. Here it is. That's odd. I've been many times at Joseph's, but I've never seen this corridor before. The photographs seem very familiar, though. What's that? This room is bizarre. What's with this furniture? <sighs> if I don't go out soon, I'll be late for work. Let's try this way. Another letter? Ventilation hole? How on earth do I fit in here? These aren't the legs I'm used to. I know this sounds ludicrous, but can it be that I'm a bug? All right, stay calm. Let's fight Jazz. Really All right, huh? Focus. You don't want to fall from this high up. What a clutter. I think there is something on the table. Another letter? Almost. Ah, made it. Ah, made it. Sticky, oh. Although, this liquid should help me climb up. What in the...
actually in the letter? What? How do they know my name? Did you transform into a bug in your bed? Are you feeling uncomfortable in your new skin? Or rather, exoskeleton? Everything seems unfamiliar and bizarre. Wondering if this is all just a bad dream? Relax. Everything is fine. Fine? This is fine? You are not the only one. There are more people like you who change into insects, but pulled through and even found a job. But I had a job. I liked it. Well, sort of. opportunities for occupational augmentation and discover a different destiny for yourself. For the best employees, restoration back to human form. Anna should bring my breakfast. I'm afraid that won't be possible. What do you mean, not possible? Preposterous, unprecedented, this is unheard of. And who then are you exactly? Were you expecting someone? On the contrary. I demand to know who you are. And is there someone behind the door? You seem excited. For sure I am. Does Miss Grubach know about this incident? I can't imagine this is acceptable for her. And who is in Frau Burstner's room? Do you know Miss Burstner well? She is my neighbor, of course I know her. I don't see how it's any Sir. Just curious. How well? Uh, we are simply acquaintances. But why does that interest you? Has she done anything wrong? Why would she have done anything wrong? I have no idea. You tell me. Enough of this chicanery. Are you the police? Is Frau Burstner in some kind of trouble? Why would she be in trouble? I don't know. You come in. Ask about her. What makes you think it's about her? 
Well, it's certainly not about me. Now, is it? You are the police. Were you expecting the police? No. No, I wasn't expecting anybody. Least of all you, whoever you are. I have to call Miss Grubach. Why do you need Miss Grubach? You just keep asking questions, don't you? Well, listen. You don't deny anything and you don't affirm anything. You just stand there and stare at me. What's your name and your function? Why do you need to know my name? Actually, you're right. I don't want to know your name. Why am I even speaking to you? Miss Gruber! She cannot come at this time. Oh, she can come at this time. It's her apartment after all. How long have you been living here? Long enough. But this situation is... I won't say another word until I see the supervisor. I clearly need some more intelligence. <laughs> Who's there? Let's see. Wouldn't you rather just stay here? I want neither to stay here nor to talk to you. I didn't mean anything wrong. Didn't France tell you to stay in your room? I demand to talk to Miss Grubach this <laughs> How would I know? I didn't make it. Anyway, I'm fine now. <laughs> so, where were we? Oh, I can't. Who's there? Let's see. Wouldn't you rather just stay here? I want neither to stay here nor to talk to you. I didn't mean anything wrong. I can't tell you to stay in your room. I demand to talk to Miss Grubach at this instant. Well, I won't be talking. What do you mean you're not talking to me? I want to speak with my landlady. No. You can't. You are arrested. Oh. Yes, it sure looks that way. Somebody must have made a false accusation. I don't see any other explanation. I'll get my pick. <laughs> 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 
Are making a big maybe you've forgotten but unlike you we are still free and that is no small advantage take me to your supervisor <laughs> as soon as he asks for it not before in the meantime don't trouble your head with matters of no importance stay focused there are many more challenges ahead Besides, do you think we'd let you see the supervisor dressed like this? He'd have you thrashed. And thus as well. Let me be, for heaven's sake. If you surprise me, while I'm in bed in the morning, you can't expect me to be in my best suit. Since you need to get changed to meet with the inspector, Mr. K. It is better to hand your personal belongings over to us. There is a lot of thieving from the storage room. Things tend to dis... My apple. And my yes. box. Ah, inside yes. I oh. should have... Oh, where is it? A 
bicycle license. I guess by the seriousness of this affair, a bicycle license should be enough. Enough for what? For identification. These are my documents. Now you And the arrest warrant. What's up, Joe?
Enter. <clears throat> Enter! Young man, why are you here? My name is Joseph Kerr. I know who you are. You are a friend of Gregor's Hamsa. Oh, you know Gregor? Didn't he refer me to you? No. No, my uncle did. He's an old acquaintance of yours. Ah, yes, of course. So, is it about your trial? Yes, it is. <sighs> You've come as a very inappropriate moment. I was told to come now. I know, but you see, my desk is broken. Oh, uh, what do you mean? Inside, I have the ledger with all the cases. Without it, I cannot work. Well, can the desk be repaired? <laughs> Probably. But for now, we must await. Mr. Hold, I would like to discuss my defense with you, but I don't even know the charges. Ah, that is not important. What is important is to submit the first set of documents to the court. The first set? What are they? The defense doesn't have access to court records, especially not to the indictment. That means we generally don't know, or at least not precisely.
Oh, it's opening. What do we have here? Oh, a certificate. Can I see it? Uh, no, no, don't worry. But your desk, it's working. Don't get so excited, Mr. K. Please, keep your composure. Mm -hmm. Now, let me see. Uh, yes, just what I thought. As we mentioned before, the first set of documents needs to be prepared. This will take some time. Uh, so what about me? Should I just wait? That's what many of the accused choose to do in this situation, as the trial is still in its infancy. Hastened action could bring more harm than good. You'll have to excuse me, but... I cannot just sit and wait. Patience is a virtue, Mr. K. A virtue much appreciated by the judicial system. I suggest you go back to your everyday tasks at the... Uh, at the bank. That is where you work, no? How can one just continue a normal everyday life knowing that he is accused? that he is a suspicion. You will be surprised to discover how easy it is to get you situation. After a certain- You can tell me when we're hearing it, right? Not really. About. Anyway, usually the first submitted documents are missed right to the end. Rumor says they are hardly ever read. This is all very regrettable, but not an hour of the date. The date. Oh, it's actually today. Your first hearing. I'm sorry. Uh, what do you mean? I have a hearing today. In the afternoon. Today? Uh, I suppose you'll be coming. Counsel for the defense is not normally allowed to be present during questioning. Anyway, not a lot can be learned in this way. It's just a formal hearing. This is all very regrettable, but not entirely without its justifications. You should not forget, Mr. K, that there is no law that says the trial has to be public. Proceedings are generally kept secret, not only from the public, but also from the accused. Is that even possible? What? To keep the trial secret from the accused. Oh, it's usually possible to a very large extent. This sounds completely absurd. So what exactly is your role? The most important thing is the lawyer's personal connections. That's where the real value of taking counsel lies. Contacts with higher officials. Or with high officials, but with lower grades. That is the only way to influence the progress of the Earth. These stamps. Oh, the certificate. Did I stamp it already? Anyway, it's official now. I'll put it with your documents. I don't quite remember why it was needed. Documents? What documents? Mr. Hold, I'm withdrawing your representation in my case with immediate effect. Uh, do I understand you right? Well, we can certainly discuss this plan of yours. It's not a plan anymore. We still mustn't rush anything. Nothing is being rushed. Everything has been thought through. Probably for too long. The decision is final. Uh, then allow me to say a few words. You are running the risk of catching a cold for no reason. The circumstances are important enough and you've become impatient. I am not impatient. It is just that I came to you hoping that this case would become less of a burden for me. Well, quite the opposite is happening. If you would represent me, I will end up worrying about the case much more. 
I will always, without ceasing, be waiting for you to do something. It will grow more and more tense. As for the information about the trial itself, supposedly held in secret, I learnt by pure luck that I have a hearing the same day. After a certain point in the proceedings, nothing new of any importance ever happens. So many litigants at the same stage in their trials have stood before me just like you are now and spoken in the same way. Then all these other litigants have been right, just as I am. I wasn't trying to show that you were mistaken, but I expected better judgment from you than from the others. I've given you more insight into the workings of the court and my own activities than I normally do. But despite that, you have too little trust in me.
in office becoming deeply corrupt when everything is devoid of meaning. That is why this
the power. I was told to come here. What next? I'm sorry, I don't understand. So? Tomorrow? So why did I come here today? To learn that I have to come back tomorrow? That doesn't make sense. But what's the verdict? You know for sure. I mean, not this class. This is the procedure. You and your procedures. You know my best friend is missing. I'm afraid something might have happened to him. Huh. Why am I thinking about him now? He might turn that back. Uh, Gregor would have helped me in this trial. He was always very agile, you know, with people he could convince them. A born salesman. Please, no for your judgment. 
You already know the verdict. I may not disclose. You already said that. Goodbye.
I was told to come here. What next? Goodbye. Oh, 
Kill to all.